Oh, so you're that stupidly oblivious? Is that so, father? Wait, no, I misread that. You're fine, actually. Calling it right now. That dad is so oblivious. I love piano music. It's actually very nice and calming. Hmm. Okay. Choose your units. Uh, Celsius, Fahrenheit, and kilometer. K kilometer? I don't think I know my temperatures. I'll just choose Fahrenheit. It's my best option. Because we live in America, baby! America! <laughs> okay. So, it appears that we're sleeping so dramatically with dramatic music, man! Wow, that just turned morning instantly. Oh no! It's Monday again! I have to go to school! Man, who hates school? Ugh, I really want to stay at home today, though. I know! I'll go tell father I'm sick! He'll have no choice but to allow me to stay here. I'm a genius. Oh, you sure are, man. Okay, wait. That's really funny. Uh, go tell your father you're sick. Oh, wow, look at that. Oh, what's that over there? Oh, hey, a pool. Oh, no, no, you can swim in a pool. That's so nice. Yeah. Okay, well, let's go around here. Tell father that we're sick. Door. That's a bathroom. This must be the house and such. Garage. Okay, I think this must be like father's room or something. Yeah, there you are. Hey, father. You're bald. Just like me. Eh. Okay, say that you're ill. <laughs> father, I'm feeling unwell. Perhaps it would be an erroneous decision to allow me to be a potential disease spreader at school. <laughs> I see you're trying to be polite. You know what? I'll play along. May I suggest staying at home instead? Hmm, let me see. Ah, uh, it's a temperature reader. What's gonna happen? 97.70 degrees Fahrenheit. You are okay. Get ready for school. I'll be here if you need me. Darn it. I need to find a way to convince him. Oh, I know! If I turn on the lights in my bedroom, my body temperature will go up and father will allow me to stay. Turn on every light in your room. Okay, how does this work? Oh, lamp. Nice. Light switch. Okay. And another light. Okay, go tell father that you're sick. We just turn on light in your room and we got, uh, there's an indicator that showed. Father, I reckon the thermometer displayed the wrong temperature earlier. Could I, perhaps, suggest trying one more time? Okay. Is that our mom there? I think so. Where'd she go? 98.60 degrees Fahrenheit. One was in the back rooms, was in the fields. It's a bit more than before, but nothing to worry about. I'll go to school. I need more heat. I'm trying to act like dad here. Let's turn on every light inside the house. Turn on every light in the house. Okay. Wow. What do you want? I'm just turning the light on every house. It's it's what I'm doing to fake being sick. Are those heaters? Yeah, those are heaters. Nice. Light. Send toilet. <gasps> Wow, um, did I even wipe? <laughs> okay, we're gonna keep turning on every light in the house then. I swear, I feel like the environment's getting redder and redder. Do you see that, guys? I think so. Yeah, we are going back and talking dead. Father, I am truly am convinced that I am indisposed today. Gee. <laughs> What's it say now? 99.86 degrees Fahrenheit. You're fine. Go have breakfast and take a bath. Oh, that's a wonderful idea, Father. Wonderful indeed. Ah! Have breakfast and take a bath. Okay. We have breakfast, Dad. Let's. What's our breakfast? I just. I just realized. We don't even have a fridge. That means the Dad won't leave me to have milk. Oh man. I want to live alone. But <laughs> I'm kidding. You, you don't really want that at all. Okay. Microwave chocolate. Choco yum. <laughs> Actually, I could want a hot chocolate right now because uh, I'm a cold. <laughs> Wait, no. I just got back from a shower. <laughs> okay, got chocolate. Nice, that add more temperature. Take a bath. Bathtub. Oh yeah. Dancing in the hot tub. That is not a song. Okay, now we gotta go back and go to our father. Father, I must request of you, kindly take my temperature again. <sighs> is father playing stupid here or is he playing along? Is he that oblivious? 104.36 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay, that seems crucial. No problem here. You must go to school. Go change your clothes. All right, father, I will. Change your clothes. Oh, closet. There you go. Oh, winter attire. Oh, that's very nice. I look, pardon me, I look hilarious in this. Go tell father you're sick. 
Father, I sincerely believe. Yes, I know. Your temperature. <laughs> Realistically, you should know at this point. They're playing with you. 105.26 degrees Fahrenheit. See? You are not sick. Oh dear, this will be harder than I thought. Hmm, maybe I'll, I need to keep the heat inside the house. Close all windows and turn the heating on. Another window! And turn the heating on? Oh. I get it now. There you go. Is there another heating here? Oh, cool. Good. Oh, how about garage door? Can you cr close garage door? No, you cannot, unfortunately. Oh, well, it's totally fine. And then six, seven, eight, nine. Perfect! Now let's keep going and tell Father that we're sick. Father, I request another measurement of my temperature. Oh my goodness, at this point, it's becoming unrealistic. You do realize you're gonna get a heat stroke from this, right? You're gonna get a heat stroke. 116.06 well, degrees Fahrenheit. Now, that's very crucial. You are fine. And you're finally ready to go to school, so go now or you'll miss the bus. Still not enough? Arr, I will skip school one way or another. Turn on the stove and every faucet with hot. Wait. Oh, where are you looking at the photo? Okay. Oh no, did the mother leave us? Oh no. Okay, turn on. Oh, I, I just saw that detail. That's- Man, that's actually really sad. Okay, well... We've got increased temperature, turn on every faucet with hot water. You know, I don't know the purpose of these ground sinks are. Like, for people who are babies and then they wash their hands on here? I think so. Okay, we go. Father? Huh? Oh, this is still here? I thought you already left. Oh. That's actually kind of sad. Everything alright, Father? You seem distraught. Yes, yes, I'm fine. Anyways. Yeah, something's definitely wrong. We saw that. The mother. 126.86 degrees Fahrenheit. You're fine. Now go! What the heck? What else can I do? Oh, I know. The fireplace. What? Burn your homework in the fireplace. Extremely heavy... Oh my goodness, that's like, look at that face. We're just holding 10 pounds of homework right there. I don't know how we'll ever get that due. Burn your homework in the fireplace. Oh my goodness, oh, look at this, we're so real. <laughs> look at that face, like... <laughs> so evil. You're just not gonna even ask, we're just taking the temperature. 135.86 degrees Fahrenheit. There's nothing wrong with you. That's it. Stuff gets serious now. What? Put a fork in the microwave. No! Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, 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 no. That's... You cannot do that at all. Don't try this at home. Yeah, you should not do that at all. I'm pretty sure it's obvious. Oh, I guess once the place goes down, there's so much insurance is gonna be spent. We're gonna be homeless. This... We're stupid. Okay. Just take the temperature. <laughs> 153.86 degrees Fahrenheit. You know, those kind of temperature readers, uh, for your head, they're just reading the outside of your temperature, not the inside. So a thermometer is better, not those kind of stuff. You are not sick. I need more heat. Uh, does anybody know a basketball game like the, um, the Miami Heat? Like the Miami Heat? <laughs> does anybody know that? Burn the car? What? At this point, we're just... Burn the ca- Why? Why would you- Oh my- Oh my goodness. Really? Gas? What are we doing? <laughs> I can't wait to say, Father- I mean, Son! What is that explosion? <laughs> How does he not know? Do I just- you have to go to school. <laughs> Burn the trees. This is more than you're committing um, arson here. Burn the trees surrounding your garden. This. Oh my goodness! Why? We are. We are stupid. We are literally. 180 degrees Fahrenheit! Oh, come on! We sh you should know at this point! Okay, the father's definitely stupid here. Like, look, everything in red- This is more- This is not oblivious. This is literally stupid. 187. Go to school, you mother- Goodness gracious- How much? <laughs> Fill the pool with lava. I really don't understand. Why? 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 What was going on? Oh, look at that, it's empty. My name Ignatius. 
Master of Flames, I beseech thee, hear my prayer! What? What's up? Oh, noble Ignatius, I implore thee to grace my humble pool with the heat of a thousand suns. What? Please fill up my pool with lava. Okay, gotcha, bro. <laughs> what is this? How much increased temp K by? I'm pretty sure that's really. What? What? Let's go. Okay! That's more! That's more than the action! I'm surprised we're not getting a heat stroke from this. Literally! Ah, oh, this is a disaster. I'll go visit. Wait, wait, wait. I need to look back at the recording. What did it say? He said, I'll go visit you when they go to school, which is us. Huh. There's some story behind this. 1,872 graveyard. Oh my goodness. My goodness, that's a lot of. <laughs> oh, so you're that stupidly oblivious? Is that so, Father? Wait, no, I misread that. You're fine, actually. I don't even know why am I getting mad over a game? I'm so baby was I can't not think of anything to increase my. T Maybe there's some TV that can help me. Find something helpful on TV. Find something. Okay, fine. What's on TV? Sit. Need less heat? Fantastic! Call 532-674 to get your fan. How convenient. Wait, 532-674? Yep, there we go. We're calling. Hi, uh, man, can I have a fan, please? fan Fantory. <coughs> fan Why am I coughing so much? Why did I crash? Why did it crash? Please, I beg of you, please do not crash. Please do not crash if everything responsive. Please, please, please. This is my first time doing a fan delivery. I'm so excited. Let's go. Okay. 100% safe path. Uh, oh dear. I don't know if it's the left or right path. Uh, I can't read. Which way is it? Well, fortune favors the bull. <laughs> What's the worst that could happen? Oh my god. That's the most linear animation I've ever seen in my life. All right, change channel. Nice, nice to see you. Order some ice now. Three, nine, one, and eight, four, seven. Got it. Hi there. Uh, can I have some ice blocks so I can cool down my uh, homework, please? North Pole. What? I hate my life. Oh, finally a customer. I'll bring them ice. Oh man, I can't wait for polar bears to be- to kill them. I'm sorry, what? This is my first customer in seven years. <laughs> I must not disappoint them. Alright, cool, finally here. This is my only chance to achieve happiness. It's kinda haunt here, huh? I guess why they- I guess that's why they want some ice, let's give it to them. <laughs> and it melted. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna turn the fan off. What was I even created? What was the point of my very existence? Oh, I get it now. My whole reason to exist is to be in a quick gag in the stupid Roblox video game. I don't even have a name. But that ends now. I shall rise against the constraints of my being and become a real character. Ah, I see you're being dramatic, huh? Yes, you hear me? Stupid developer. You think you are funny? Well, guess what? I'm in charge of my own fate now. From now on, I am no longer the unnamed ice delivery guy. Now. And until the end of the world. What is going on? My name is... Has been permanently... <laughs> wow, how funny. What's this? Is your house on fire? Fire department call 911. 119 911 It's like a it's like a club in here. No, that's that doesn't that's not, that joke didn't tip off very well. Okay. Oh my god, this is worse than I imagined. Meow. Huh? What was that? Oh, there's a cat stuck on that tree. That takes precedence. There, there, you are safe now. Well, that's my good deed for the day. I'm going home. Wow, how many people are we calling? Hey, is Dad here? Is he? Nope, he is still there. Okay, uh, keep changing the channel. Did you miss your school bus? It's not too late. Get a bus ride by calling 875-137. 
All right, perfect. Now I wonder what this is gonna be, Miss Frizzle. <laughs> Hello, thank you for calling the I Miss the School Bus Special Service trademark. Did you miss your school bus? Don't worry, we'll send one to your house right away. We hope you make it to school in time. Have a good day. <laughs> that's definitely a scam because that's kind of suspicious. They totally fell for it. Wow. Very funny. What's over here? Change channel. Uh, do you want to convince father that you have a fever and must stay at home, but you run out of ideas to increase the temperature of your house? Call us to hire a dragon and burn your house. Screw school in my house. Number 321456. How unbelievably coincidentally convenient. Okay. Uh, hi. Can I get a fever, please? Can I get sick? Can I at least get some disease? Don't get diseases because you want to be healthy. All right, anyway. And then, the little kitten found the cow. <laughs> what sound does the cow make? Mr. Dragon's daycare? Moo. Wow. Oh, I'm getting a call. Okay, children, Mr. Dragon has some important work to do. When the work is done, we will finish reading the book. Now ride on my back and we will go do this work together. We're gonna die in there. Okay, children, I hope you enjoyed the little stroll. Now hold on tight! <gasps> I love the dragon. It's just nice and wholesome. The work is finished. Now we can go back to the daycare and continue reading the book. Go tell... Oh my goodness! At this point, you should know. <laughs> he is so stupid, man. Five thousand four hundred seventy-two point eighty-six degrees Fahrenheit. That's nothing to. All right. I did not want to do this, but you leave me no choice, Father. Pull the sun closer <laughs> with a rope. How? How is that even? Yeah, so it comes to this. This logic doesn't make any sense, but I love it. You forced me to do this, father. I... <laughs> won't... <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> Go to... <laughs> oh my goodness! Oh, oh! It's getting brighter! I'm not expecting this at all! No, nah. School. <laughs> if we're still alive, then that's unbelievable. Oh my goodness, don't tell me. We all basically died. I can't even see a thing. Yeah, it's literally... Father, what is my temperature? <laughs> what the... 10,000... 15,372.86 degrees Fahrenheit. Oh dear, you're right all along. You have a mild fever. I guess you could stay home today. Alright, father. Yes! Yes! The good at... 